بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله على سيدنا ومولانا محمد وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين. Carrying on from our last lesson, uh, we're looking at the major signs of the day of judgment. The major signs of the day of judgment. And one of the major signs we mentioned was the coming of Isa alayhi salam. Sayyiduna Isa alayhi salam. And Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam in English is known as Jesus. The coming of Isa alayhi salam is a major sign of the day of judgment. Isa alayhi salam was not killed nor did he die but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala raised him into the heavens. Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam was not killed nor did he die. But we believe that he was raised to the heavens by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will send him back into this world before the day of judgment. Isa alayhi salam will be sent back into this world before the day of judgment. And our Prophet Muhammad alayhi salatu was salam, he mentioned during the miraj, the miraj of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi salam, I met Isa alayhi salam on the second heaven and I found him of medium structure and reddish white comple uh, complexion. He said he met Isa alayhi salam and his body was so clean and clear that it appeared that he has just, uh, though he has just performed ghusl, he has performed ghusl and kamar. That's how clear and uh, that's how clear and clean Isa alayhi salam appeared on the night of Mi'raj. And the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said, I met him on the second heaven. And we mentioned in the last lesson that Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam, he will descend near the eastern minaret of the Umayyad mosque in, in Damascus. Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam, he will descend near the, he will descend on the eastern minaret of the Umayyad mosque in Damascus in Syria wearing two yellow sheets and leaning on the shoulders of two angels. Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam, he will, descend wearing, uh, he will descend wearing two yellow sheets and leaning on the shoulders of two angels. His hair will be spread to his shoulders, straight, neat and shining. He will return as a follower of Sayyidina Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wasallam. Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam, when he will return to the earth, he will be from the followers of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam. He will return as a follower of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam from his ummah, not a, a prophet himself. He will join a group of righteous people who will be preparing war against the Jal. Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam, when he will descend on the eastern minaret of the Umayyad mosque, he will descend wearing, a yellow, uh, wearing two yellow sheets and is uh, leaning on the shoulders of two angels and his hair will spread and they will, be, they will spread to his shoulders straight, neat and shining. And he will return as a follower of the Prophet ﷺ. And when he will descend, he will join a group of righteous people. People who will be preparing for war against the Jal. It will be the time of for Fajr prayer and Imam Mahdi will appear, will be the leader of the Muslims. It will be the time of Fajr and Imam Mahdi alayhi salam, he will be, he will be the leader of the Muslims. And suddenly, they, a voice will be heard saying, One who listens to your pleas has come. One who listens to your pleas has come. And at the time of arrival, at that time of arrival, his arrival, the Jal will be ready, will have, uh, will, the Jal will ready have emerged, and the Jal will start melting from the beautiful fragrance of Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam's breath. The Jal, just from the breath of the, uh, Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam, he will start to melt. Just like salt melting in water, Isa alayhi salam will chase him and kill him. This is what we learn. This will, this will all happen in the future, near the uh, day of judgment. And this is one of the major signs of the day of judgment. That Isa alayhi salam will kill him. Will kill who? The Jal. And Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam, he will also break the cross and kill the pigs during, the time on the earth, during his time on earth. The cross that the Christians worship or the, the cross that they have, Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam, he will come to break this cross and kill the pigs during the time on earth. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will end every other religion except for Islam. There will be peace and security on earth. It will be, there will be peace and tranquility on earth. So that the lions will be so it will be so peaceful, so the lions will be at peace with the camels and children will be able to play with the snakes without being harmed. That's how much peace we will see. 
Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam will marry and have children and he will stay in the world for 40 years. Isa ibn Maryam, he will, be, he, will mar- he will get married and have children and he will stay in the world for 40 years. Then he will pass away and be laid uh, in the shrine next to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa Isa alayhi salam, when he die, when he will die, he will be buried next to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa in the mosque, in the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa mosque in Medina al munawwara Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam will be from the followers of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa He will be from his ummah and he will have children and he will get married and then he will stay in this world for 40, day, uh, 40 years, sorry. 40 years, and then he will be passed away and then he will be laid next to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa He will be buried next to the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa there is a place there for Sayyidina Isa alayhi salam, where in the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa mosque in Medina al-Munawwara. Wa akhurda wa alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen.